Welcome to Tech Brothers with Damir. In this video, we are going to learn how to insert multiple rows in MySQL table in single insert statement. So let's take a look. First of all, what you will say, you will say insert into and table name. Then you will provide the list of the columns for which you would like to insert the values. So you have these in the parentheses here, column one, column two, comma, column three and four and whatever, the number of columns you want to insert to the data. Then you will say values and you start with parentheses. Again, value for column one, value for column two and comma and then keep going. So you, this is the first row of data you are putting in the table. Then you are gonna say for the second row, you start with comma again and then start provide the values for the second row then again comma and provide the third row you will repeat uh, for the number of the rows you want to insert uh, in below example of what we are doing we are creating customer table with ID customer first name last name age phone number date of birth and gender columns uh, so let's create this table and uh, here what we have uh, okay the table already exists so we don't have to create it anyways and then the next part uh, you are saying uh, we see insert into and table name customer so you have the list of the columns in which you would like to provide uh, the values of so first name last name age phone number date of birth and gender and then you will say values uh, and uh, this is our first row so you start with parentheses and provide the value for the first column so this uh, value goes in the first name second uh, uh, this is a Shahzad one that goes in last name 31 39 is age and this is a phone number then uh, you have date of birth and then you have gender then you say comma and provide the next rows uh, you repeat for the numbers of rows you want to insert uh, okay uh, there are some uh, things to remember he see here we have ID customer and I did not add any value for ID customer because it's auto increment so it will increase automatically every time you insert the row okay if uh, you are not interested uh, to insert the data for some column let's say if you are not interested to uh, put the age uh, you can uh, uh, simply remove the age part of it uh, so select the columns in which you would like to put the data and then provide the values um, if the column is defined as not null that means you have to have a uh, provide the value for that uh, column let's say gender if i will try not to provide the gender here then it will throw error because i'm saying not null that means i have to have provided the value okay let's insert this uh, couple of records and uh, the two rows are inserted if we want to select the data there could be a little more data because uh, i was running this test already so okay run this statement and you can see that uh, we have two rows inserted by using single insert statement where we have to separate the list of the row by just with single column here and this is how you are going to insert multiple rows thanks very much for watching this video and i hope this will help i will see you guys in the next video